Shone Ash Canyon Bridge has always been our lifeline to much of the alliance of free cities. When it was destroyed, our survival hung in the balance. But when the going gets tough, sand rockers get tougher. We all played our part in rebuilding this bridge, but let's give a special round of applause for our core construction team. I would also like to thank the world-renowned businessman, Mr. Musa, as well as the Alliance of Free Cities for their generosity. Much of the budget for this bridge was donated by Mr. Musa after he heard about our predicament. Now with that out of the way, I call upon our own Dr. T to cut this here ribbon and hereby declare this bridge reopened. Has anyone seen Dr. G?
Fantastic news, newbie! You're being promoted, and your first task in your new position is to build and place a yak mill stop over by Gecko Station. Here's a diagram. Bye bye now. Huh? <laughs> well, uh, no, you'd be making exactly the same. Just with this additional responsibility, uh, it's more about the uh, prestige of being promoted. As a matter of fact, there have been a lot of people complaining about the quality of your work as of late. I didn't want to say it, but actually, this task to build and place a yak mill stop over by the gecko station is a punishment. Do this thing for me, and I'll let you off the hook for all your recent bad behavior. Gosh, you're so lucky to have a cool boss like me. I'm glad we had this chat. Good luck! Finally, this is it! The 68 degree latitude range, ultra fine axis controls. It's got to be accurate at least to 7 arc seconds. And do you hear that? Exactly. Silence. But if you place your ear just so, you can hear the motor drive purring like a diminutive kitten. This equatorial mount looks like it could counterbalance a pretty sizable telescope which confirms my postulation that the old world metropolis that Sandrock sits upon must have dealt with space-related industries. There must have been some old world observatories under the sand. Now that we have a mount, it only stands to reason that there are also telescopes somewhere in the ruins too. Maybe even rocket engines and starship... Now I'm getting ahead of myself. Anyhow, I implore you, find a telescope and restore it for science. Lately I've been looking into finding a better oxidizer for my hypergolic... Oh, that's right. You have no idea what that is. Recently I invented... bread. How's that? Is this a mutually uplifting conversation? If data from the Civil Corps surveys are reliable, I think there might be some telescope parts deep down the Gecko Station abandoned ruins. Not sure how they got into a transport hub. Maybe a few buildings got crunched together back when a calamity happened. Are the Civil Corps letting us use those nowadays? I'll have to check and get back to you. 
Await my further correspondence by, um, keeping an eye on your mailbox. Excellent work, Builder. Thank you. That will be all.
Hey there. Thank you. 
Hey there. Bye. 